So my bees are up here, up this, this hill here, uh, on the edge of a field, small field, on this farm where I keep them. And uh, I'd say it's about 100 feet away. I'm going to say about 100 feet. I don't know. I'm not good with feet, but I'm saying about 100 feet. And this is my swarm box. It's basically a, a six frame nuke. You might be able to get seven in there, but it's about a six frame deep nuke. And it's got a, I think it's a one and a half inch hole right here. I've got a couple other holes in it and I've got a uh, taped together top cover and it's got some drone comb and just some old comb thrown in there. And this is basically how I catch bees. If there's a swarm in the area, the bees are going to be scouting around looking for a place to live and they'll go, they, they, you know, I, I know you think they're going to go up top in a big tree like this and it'll be a big racket and you got to put your swarm trap up in a tree, but this works too. Just, they, if they're looking for a place to live they, and they can't find a place like up in a tree, they'll take the place that's, uh, you know, in a sheltered area with a bit of sun, two or three feet off the ground. It, it, it works. So whenever I, whenever I leave this location, I check that box um, as I'm leaving and just to make sure there's, I, I, if there's any uh, swarming going on. And uh, so far it's, it's done its job. I, I didn't catch any swarms this year and I can tell that my, none of my colonies have swarmed. But uh, I was thinking it was last year I got a swarm in it, and it works. It works perfectly. I didn't have to, you know, put it up in a tree.